We are currently documenting our part-time van life journey in our VW24. This week we were in East Sussex and found arguably one of my favourite spots ever. We've done a mini tour of East Sussex, even visited Brighton and Eastbourne and then headed back to Kent for the last night. Feel free to subscribe to follow our journey. We post new content every Tuesday. We hope you enjoy the video. The South Downs in oh my God. near Brighton. The South Downs, in, well, near Brighton. South Downs in. Where are we? <laughs> South Downs. <laughs> Tomorrow we are going to Brighton, Brighton for the day. Gonna look around the vintage shops. Gonna try and get some bargains. There is nothing around, it's literally just landscape. It's crazy. Only took an hour and 40 to get here. So the sun is just about to set. I think we might get back to the van soon. Get some steak and veg on the go. But uh, yeah, perfect night. You can even see the sea from here. How mad is that? And you can see the sea. And where we're parked, you can see literally everywhere around. It's like a 360 view. That is why it's so highly rated. Yeah, I think that's why it's so. But to be fair, there's not a lot of There's vans. about six vans there, which ain't yeah. bad. Six vans, I thought it'd be very busy. Wow. <laughs> so we're just heading back to the van. Probably one of the best spots we've been to, I reckon. Yeah, well, best sunset spots, I reckon. 100%, look at it. On the hill, just see the end of it. Get back to the van, have a bit of steak and veg, chill for a bit, and then get to Brighton tomorrow. So this is the view from the other side of our uh, spot for the night. You can see it. <laughs> Not too many bands. Quite a Right there on top of the moon We could sit and do nothing I wish we were both To just fly away I don't wanna care It's being I'm good Alone Are we okay? Cause you like I'm too scared now Just go out of bed I've been up a bit longer Seven o'clock. Yeah, it's time to shush. We're gonna head to Brighton today, have a look around the shops, and then find another spot for tonight.
Can you be here and I'm good? Alone. I'll be okay with you like an old friend. Too scared now, thinking I should call up on the As you can tell, I'm the chef of the camping trip. I'm the chef of every camping trip. It's still a runny yolk. Nice. So that doesn't look like all very breakfast. <laughs> nah. <laughs> We're cutting boards first, Jace. Eggs. And bacon. It's a nice cutting board, to be fair, isn't it? Very nice. Have you took the price stick off? Uh, I haven't took the price stick off <laughs> because I did get it for a bargain. <laughs> That's a remind you. Washed up, packed up, and no one's even. eight o'clock. No one's even awake yet. We just parked. We've gone down two bus lanes, bus and taxis only. Gone the wrong way down the one way. Gone the wrong way down the one way, and now just with an inch to spare fit in a car park. So today's going well so far. <laughs> New coffee maker, a new water bottle. Mm -hmm. We made it to Brighton in the end. Yeah. Well, we got here and none of the shops are open, so yeah. we're walking around for about an hour. Got loads of Doing nothing. Got coffee and a coffee maker. Got loads of stuff in the van. Go see if anything's open now. And check out some shops now, see what's going on. See if it's a bit more lively. Quite a long walk, wasn't it? It was a long walk. <laughs> I'm sweating. <laughs> We've just turned up to a spot uh, to stay for the night. Got here and it's Ramo. Very Ramo. It's really small as well. About fucking 20 cars there. <laughs> it's really unlevel, so, but there's wild horses. Yeah, there is wild horses. And cows. So we might get back to the spot we stayed at last night. Maybe. We're yeah. going to go back after this and see if it's as busy as it was. And if it is, then we'll go back to the other spot because we want to be level. Yeah. Look, right, there's my finger, right there, and you can see how busy it is from here as well, that is literally how big the car park is, and if you can't fit in, like we discovered when we first got there, you have to reverse the whole way back. <laughs> Yeah. 
This is the uh, ornament we got in Brighton right today. today. How much was it? Five pound. Five pound. Bargain. Well. Oh, where's the jar? We got a jar for one pound as well. Look at that. How nice will that look with a little plant in it? But yeah, so we've got nice this because it reminded us of barley. It's like solid brass as well. We've got to get something to stick him on though. Just going to another spot now to have a bit of breakfast because there's a load of farmers in the other one <laughs> doing some farmer stuff on the field. Literally about 20 defenders. We've had our lunch, sausage and bacon roll. Dank. You received eight pound. Because we're YouTube influencers now, and we're like famous and that, so if you could just transfer some money to travel full time, that'd be greatly appreciated. <laughs> and this is our view. For the afternoon spot. So we've still got to get our cabinet fitted. So uh, it'll be about there, wouldn't it? Yeah, come up to about there. Nice drawer on it to put our cutlery. Little sink on the top. Little pull out drawer for our fridge, sink on the top. <laughs> in Eastbourne going to look around the charity shops to see if we can find some bargains for Leanne <laughs> Some hummus and dip. <laughs> hummus and, and dip. Hummus and dip. Look at that. Where is my super soup? <laughs> so we didn't really film much in the charity shops because why? Because I forgot. <laughs> We're just sitting here now. Gonna have some dinner in a bit. We'll show you what we got from the charity shops as well. We've got this little basket for three pound. Nice little picnic basket. Bill got his hat he's wearing now. My hand's shaking so much. What else did we get? Oh, um, new jumper for Bill. New jumper. Um, and that was it really. We, didn't... we did get something else. I was gonna buy another water bottle. Yeah, Bill was gonna buy another water bottle. Is this one? It's it too small. Nice, but the other one. It had a better pattern on it. That's, like that. that's his excuse for. It's fine. <laughs> it's a fine wine. <laughs> so this will be our third time in this spot now. This was the fir the first place we come. This spot's also really highly rated on Park for Night. The only annoying thing is the lake's here and you have to park like at the car park over there. But it's only like a two minute walk.
class done. Bill's cooking up the pasta. Audi! 75p special. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, I think this was the uh, expensive range of £1.15. <laughs> oh my god, extortion. You can just hear the bell. It weren't a minute ago, you see a Yeah, some <laughs> random person that sounded like they were screaming in a different language, which is always good when you're by a lake that looks like a murder scene. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is your partner, you shit. Has the whole world gone crazy? Am I the only one here who gives a shit about the rules? Mark at zero! <laughs> Bed time. That is some Duke of Edinburgh type shit. That way. Lantern on a branch. Very, uh... It looks like it was always there. We've actually got a porch light now. Bill's got his little key hook on the seat belt holder. So efficient, this boy. <laughs>